It's a tradition that requires every man, woman and child to pitch in. <laughs> The Angami tribe of Nagaland hasn't held a stone pulling ceremony in decades, but they certainly haven't forgotten how. We still admire it because it encouraged the people to work hard. Hard work indeed. The entire village, about 10,000 people, have turned out to drag this massive stone, five and a half metres long and almost two metres wide, along a one kilometre stretch of road. It's thirsty work, even for the toughest tribesmen. It's one of dozens of events at this year's Hornbill Festival, a celebration of culture and history. in the name of peace and unity. While the Naga people share many traditions, intertribal conflict remains a problem. Organisers hope the festival will go some way towards uniting the Naga people. We are widely divided, but uh, we have uh, the <coughs> emotional integration, culture, social and political integration. There are 16 Naga tribes represented here at the festival, but there are many more in other parts of India and Myanmar. The organisers of the festival hope in the future more tribes will join in. Celebrating the past in the hope of a brighter future.